Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel, Canada PR. We hope you're doing great. Well, in this episode, we'll talk about Get Canada PR without IELTS. Canada is a highly sought after destination for individuals seeking permanent residency, PR, due to its excellent quality of life, educational opportunities, and robust job market. While proficiency in English or French is typically required for immigration, many wonder if it's possible to secure a Canada PR without taking the IELTS exam. In this comprehensive guide, we will explore the various routes and alternatives available to aspiring immigrants, shedding light on how to achieve Canadian PR without the IELTS language proficiency test. So, to get all the information, pay attention and watch the video through to the end please hit like and subscribe, and don't forget to push the notification bell for upcoming episodes. So, without any further delay, let's jump into the video. How to get Canada PR without IELTS Canada attracts a vast number of overseas students by providing high-quality education as well as a good level of living. Many individuals who desire to study in Canada want to know how to move there and obtain a study permit without taking the IELTS exam. A degree from a Canadian educational institution means receiving a high-quality education at a reasonable cost. Students have access to a wide range of research and internship possibilities during their studies. Suppose you've ever considered migrating to Canada and want to learn about Canadian immigration without IELTS. In that case, this article will teach you how to apply for a Canada PR visa without IELTS. After obtaining permanent resident status, candidates can easily find a job that suits their talents and live and work in the province of their choice. Canada PR without IELTS Overview SELPIP is the alternative English language proficiency examination to get Canada PR without IELTS. If you have a close family member who possesses Canadian citizenship, they can sponsor you through a sponsorship program and assist you in obtaining permanent residency in Canada. If this individual has been in Canada for more than a year and has permanent status, they can function as your sponsor. Canada is one of the best places to live, and the general facilities and services offered to the public are among the best in many countries. If you have a work visa or are sponsored by your family or employer, you can work or study in Canada without taking the IELTS exam. To apply for permanent residency, you must demonstrate language competency. However, there are alternatives to the IELTS exam. Canada Permanent Resident Visa Benefits Live, work, and settle in Canada indefinitely with no restrictions. Earn twice as much as you are now and work for any firm you want. If you are married, your spouse and children can travel without requiring an additional family visa. Children receive free education, and spouses can work for any corporation in Canada. There is no need to pay for your or your family's medical treatment since the Canadian government will pay for it all. After three years, you can apply to become a Canadian citizen. What I need for Canada immigration. Under 40 years old. Bachelor's degree in any discipline. A minimum of two years of work experience. A score of 67 in Canada's points-based immigration selection system for the ability to speak, read, and write English. There is no criminal history. Good health. How to apply for PR in Canada without IELTS. The Canadian government has implemented some immigration schemes to assist people in obtaining permanent status in Canada. Although IELTS is the most often used exam for these programs, other options, such as the Canada Language Benchmark, are also available. For immigration purposes, Canadian jobs have been classified into five different skill types. This is referred to as the National Occupation Classification. Skill Type 0, this grouping includes all management positions. Skill Level A, this category is used to identify jobs that require a university level or degree. Skill Level B, this category includes technical professions that require a college diploma or training before being hired. Skill Level C, these jobs require job-specific training. Skill Leveled, this type refers to labor jobs in Canada that offer on-the-job training. Minimum IELTS Score Requirements There are three types of pathways to get PR status in Canada. Federal Skilled Worker Program Federal Skilled Trades Program Canadian Experience Class because IRCC takes six months to process your application, you must ensure your IELTS exam results are valid for the entire time. A minimum language proficiency of CLB 7, or 6.0 in each component of the IELTS test, is required for permanent residency through express entry. There are varying language competency requirements for each program. Your language abilities are evaluated using four subcategories, hearing, reading, writing, and speaking. CLB level determines how many points you gain, Canadian language benchmark. Federal Skilled Worker Program. For people who speak English as their first language, there are no points awarded if you get CLB 4 or lower. If you get CLB 10 or higher, you will get the most points, which are 34 or 32. 
If you are married. Image here. If English is your second language, you will receive 4 points if you meet the per section requirements. Image here. Federal Skilled Trades Program. The section score requirements for each CLB level are listed below. Image here. Canadian Experience Class. For NACA positions, CLB 7 is the minimum language requirement. CLB 5 is required for NACB employment. The CLB levels that correspond to per section IELTS scores are listed below. Image here. Provincial Nominee Program, PNP. To be eligible for permanent residency through any Canadian PNP, you must meet the below conditions. You will be required to submit confirmation of your English language skills. The skill types you can apply will vary depending on your province. Whether or not you are required to have job experience is determined by the province to which you are applying. Job experience, job offers, and the amount of education required depend on the eligibility of the specific provincial nominee programs. Important PNP program for Canada PR visa. Here is the PNP, provincial nomination program, list to get Canada PR for international students. PNP program. Saskatchewan PNP. Ontario PNP. Nova Scotia PNP. Alberta PNP, New Brunswick PNP, British Columbia PNP, Yukon PNP, Manitoba PNP, Prince Edward Island PNP, Quebec PNP, Newfoundland PNP, NT PNP. Can I migrate to Canada without IELTS? If you want to migrate to Canada, you don't need IELTS. You can do it without the language proficiency test. However, it's essential to understand the Canadian immigration process and meet specific requirements. If you're a student, You'll likely qualify for a study visa or program that meets the definition of an internationally validated program of studies. Make sure to research the Canadian immigration system thoroughly and be prepared to answer any questions the immigration officer may have. Working in Canada without IELTS. Many people travel to Canada in search of better working conditions. Employee services are excellent, and quality of work is prioritized over quantity. The IELTS exam measures English language proficiency. It is to demonstrate that you have the necessary language skills, listening, speaking, reading, and writing, to settle and work in Canada after migration successfully. IELTS is not a required exam for obtaining a work visa in Canada. Some firms or employers may expressly require that you take the IELTS exam and submit your score before being hired. If this occurs, you will be required to take the exam, but most businesses do not need IELTS as the only language exam. Work permit in Canada without IELTS. Students who have earned a graduate degree from a Canadian university are more likely to want to stay in the same nation. It can be challenging at times because they should be able to obtain a work permit, be eligible for Canada PR, or both. To qualify for a post-graduation work permit, you must meet the following criteria. You must be at least 18 years old when submitting your application. The degree program you pursue in Canada should be full-time and continuous. The study program should have lasted at least 8 months. The university where you earned your degree should have been a registered educational institution. You should have university credentials confirming that you completed the course and its core components. Students must submit the work permit application within 90 days of completing the study course. When you apply for this study permit, you must have a valid work permit. You should also be aware that the IELTS score for a Canada work visa varies greatly depending on the job and occupation. A nurse, for example, must have a minimum IELTS score of 6.5 but a lawyer must have a minimum IELTS score of 7.0. International people from over 150 nations call Canada home, and the Canadian government has lately made it easier to get Canadian permanent residency and a work visa. The IELTS English proficiency exam result is one of the criteria. Though the IELTS score for a Canada work visa varies depending on the entrance pathway, skilled immigrants are advised to earn a minimum of 6.0 as their cumulative and component-wise IELTS score to avoid roadblocks. Securing permanent residency in Canada is a dream for many, and not having to take the IELTS exam can make the journey more accessible for some. Whether through alternative language exams like CELPIP, family sponsorship, or provincial nomination programs, there are viable pathways to achieve Canada PR without IELTS. It's essential for prospective immigrants to assess their eligibility, understand program requirements, and embark on this exciting journey to become part. That is all for today, in this video. What are your thoughts on this? Please let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching the entire video. Hopefully, the information is useful to you. See you later, in the next episode. Till then, take care. Hello everyone, welcome.
welcome back to our channel Canada PR we hope you are doing great well in this episode we will talk about Canada offers numerous opportunities for individuals to obtain permanent residency without having to attack the IELTS exam this article explores alternative pathways to a secure PR status in Canada highlighting various immigration programs like best of proficiency requirements and important consideration one viable alternative to IELTS is the CELPIP Canadian English Language Proficiency Index Program exams which assess a language proficiency for PR purposes additionally if you have a close family members who are Canadian citizens or permanent resident they can sponsor you through a family sponsorship program Canada provide a numerous benefits to its permanent residents including the freedom to leave work and a settle anywhere in the country permanent residents uh, can also enjoy healthcare coverage free education for our children and the opportunity to apply for a canadian citizenship after a few years thanks for watching the entire video hopefully the information is useful to you see you later in next episode till then take care